Yo, what is going on guys? It is your boy Pup. Today we have week 7 of the GWA. A tough loss to Drees in the last week. Um, but technically we are still in it. Like, I'll say it in this that I'm out of it, but technically if these two last weeks go really well and other people do bad, we're still in the playoff run even with a, a potential like three wins. So I'm going to try my best. You know, I'm not giving up on the season. Um, and, I mean, it was just more of a season for fun after winning last season anyways. So, I mean, it is what it is. But I hope you guys enjoy it. And I'll see you guys in the battle. All right. We are connected here to Mackie. Um, they do bring the Rambi. So, my tech of the week is Pheasant Deputy with a Choice Scarf um, to counter this Rambi lead. I also am bringing Rain with Choice Specs Bas Basket Legion. A defensive Pelipper, which counters the Garchomp decently if it's physical. Um, Focus Sash, Lycanroc. We have Spin Colossal, if I didn't say that. Power Herb, Archaladon with Meteor Beam. Uh, that was for Rotom, but we don't see Rotom. We also don't see uh, any real removal for them, which is nice. So, no Serena, and they have Umbreon. Um, but I already know what I'm leading. They do too. All right. Um, let's get rid of all these other guys. No Serena. What else did they not have? Yeah, that looks about right. All right, I hope my music's working. I don't know, it's kind of slow, but yeah. They lead with this. I lead with the Pheasantipity. Here, let me see if I can fix this real quick. I don't know if that worked. Whatever. All right, but we have dual wing beat, 100% chance to KO. We're choice scarf, and that thing is dead. Good turn one KO for us. And no webs are coming up against me. Which that's good because they probably have like a Specs Keldeo based on them bringing webs. Um, definitely like Sweeper sort of potential. Maybe uh, a Sword Stance Garchomp. Something like that. I could have Nasty Plot Golden Go. That would be really scary Mon to come out right now. Man. Yeah, and they're definitely going to be caught off guard by that. I'm really happy that I ended up bringing this thing. It also is just really nice. They go Jaws 3D. That's the Garchomp. I mean, we always just go out to Pelipper here. Um, because we get the free rain up. We are immune to Earthquake. If they want Stone Edge, it's going to do a decent chunk. But we're super physically defensive on this thing. So let's see. Yeah, we get the rain. And they do sword stance. Okay. So they're offensive. Let me uh, pull up my calyx here. Garchomp, sword stance. Plus two. Scale shot cannot kill us. Um, unless they're like adamant. Um, Stone Edge does though. Um, Stone Edge does most of the time. It's actually a, a roll. Um, but we're going to go for Ice Beam here. It's going to do a ton to them. As they are scale shot, that's going to do a ton of damage. All right. Please do not get five because it looks like they're adamant. Come on. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Adamant with four hits never would have killed, but they got five. Save a speed boost. Ah, oh, man, that sucks. <laughs> um, I think... We can go Basket Legion in the rain, though. Um, we always knock them out with Choice Specs Hydro Pump. Surf against them is an 81% chance to knock them out. So I think we're going to go for that. Because we always have a Cell Rock in the back if we need it. But getting this thing out of the way is really nice. Yeah, let's just click Surf here in the rain. We're outrunning them. We're modest, modest specs. They don't have a switch into this thing. So a kill here would be best. Um, let me get rid of my Pelipper. It's annoying to lose that so early, though. But that's why I do have Power Herb. Power Herb Electro Shot is going to go crazy once this thing is gone. Get us a special attack boost, man. That's what we like to see. Yeah, this thing is definitely adamant. If they were jolly, um, we'd still outrun them, though. 
I just like based on that scale shot damage, they're obvious. It's like completely obvious to me. Um, because oh, they do end up withdrawing. That's crazy. Well, I guess they keep that thing in the back. Trixie Keldio? No, Umbreon. This thing is gonna take a ton. Yep, that takes 50%. That thing is fully physically defensive. That's crazy. Alright, let me check this out. Honestly, they're not even like max HP. This is probably a a very much roll in their favor to live this. But I'm gonna click it again. I mean, maybe if they're just offensive. But no, we get a crit there. It might have mattered. It looked like they were just under half, so I mean, who knows? But Umbreon's down. I mean, those are some huge threats to me. Obviously, Keldeo is a massive threat still. Especially because I have the rain up for him. And they're going to go Golden Go. Okay. Um, Choice Scarf Golden Go cannot outspeed me because we're in the rain. And Surf should kill if they're offensive. Um, it obviously seems like they're defensive, but we're going to Surf anyways. This is going to do a ton. <sighs> Leaves them on 1 HP. And this Shadow Ball should knock me out. And we live on 9. Are you kidding? All right. There's another one for Basque Legion. I mean, they may end up going Keldeo. If they go Keldeo, then we have to preserve, I think. Nope, we just get Golden Go down. All right. Um, Keldeo, if they're Calm Mind, is scary here. Um, in the rain, we still do a ton. They end up going Maple. Who is that Keldeo? So we're still in the rain. Like, Surf is over 50%. Um, but if there are leftovers, I mean, we need this chip no matter what for Lycanroc or even for the Scarf and Dipity in the back uh, as they have Aqua Jet. That makes sense. So Basque Legion dies. I think that said it was a crit. That's kind of funny. But it's all right. We can go our Chaladon here. And they might expect us to be like Assault Vested. Secret Sword cannot knock me out. Because they're obviously not specs. I think we just get... Hmm. We could Electro Shot. We could also just Draco. Now, I don't hate that at all. They're at full HP. We could also go Fezzendipity. Because Fezzendipity um, with Play Rough looks really great into their team right now. But I think we're going to go our Chaladon first. And Electro Shot's probably the play here. I'm going to make the aggressive Draco Meteor play. It gets us the chip that we need anyways. Um, but if they want to bring in Garchomp to try to stomp out my Electro Shot, then we should knock them out since they're offensive. Yep, they withdraw. Come on, let me see it. Let me cook them. Let me cook. Let me cook. Yep, there they are. And we hit the Draco. Goodbye, Garchomp. Let's go. All right, I'm playing out of my mind right now. This is a very, very, very fast-paced game, though. Literally been eight minutes. But now our Chaladon, no rain. or minus two special attack. I don't really know what they're going to do, though. Like that Keldeo, I mean, it, no, they bring in the Torn. I don't really know what the Torn does, though. Um, but Colossal is meant for this thing, kind of. Um, we obviously don't have a good move for it, but we are especially defensive. So I'm going to go out to it here. Oh, and they predict it and go, well, I mean, it's just a good play no matter what. Folks Blast, we do live one. Um, it does... 206. Focus Blast um, to my Colossal. Did 206. So they're like max offensive, I think. 
Yeah. Now this, I think we always live based on what I'm seeing here. Um, we could set up rocks if we want. I don't think they're that important. I think we're just going to get some chip with flamethrower on this guy. As the U turn out. Okay. Good to know. We're still, um, it's a 50% roll now, um, for that folks blast to kill me. But yeah, they go out to maple. Um, sub call mine is scary here though. Sub call mine is definitely super scary. I think we make an aggressive play and go out straight to pheasantipity. Cause this thing could still be specs. Pheasantipity has a decent special defense. We should live any hit. Um, and then we can dual wing beat through. Um, if they want to set up a sub, we can also play rough, which should knock them out as well. All right, go hard out and they aura sphere. Great. And it does absolutely nothing that did what 50 damage, 45 damage, something like that. Um, aura sphere. Yeah, that's actually specs. That's timid specs. So I think what we're going to do, how much do we do to Torn? Um, they're offensive. Play rough is actually a two at KO on most of them. So we're just going to play rough. And we might just sweep through with Pheasantipity. Might not even need anyone else to hit the field. We'll see. We do land the play rough. Does just about 50%. All right. Just got to land a couple more. We land that one, gonna take out Torn. Masterclass right here by Pheasantipity. Just going crazy. The choice specs, I don't even think they can knock me out unless like somehow Hydro. Um, but this play rough does 86 to 102. So it's a roll definitely here. We hit it and we knock him out. Let's go, big 4-0 victory over Mackey there. Great, great stuff. I feel like I prepped a lot better than I have in the last couple of weeks and uh, brought some really good stuff. I hope you guys enjoyed this battle. I really enjoyed it, even though we're like out of the playoffs. Um, you know, it feels really good to come back and have a big win um, where it's just, you know, I I completely outplayed them. I feel like I brought a bunch of really good stuff and I played very, very well. But that's about it for me. If you guys enjoyed, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.